right, everybody, here we go. I've got an echo I've got to take care of real quick. As you can hear. There it is. I love when the stream decides to just randomly start pumping my music at me. Hi, everybody! We are here for the first weekly community top 100 tournament. We're still uh, shuffling things around in the background, trying to get things set up. But I'm glad you're all here. Um, at the moment, I believe it is PC-based, Almighty Wicked, but they are working on getting something for the Xbox community, too, because we know that that is a growing and very passionate community. We want to have all sorts of prizes for everybody involved. If you are new to Mixer here, uh, I've posted it uh, a couple times. I've got a chat command added for it right now, but you will be able to click on the icon in the top right corner of your Mixer window just above the chat here. If you go to accounts, you will get a free name change. You can actually change your name on Mixer every 90 days if you so desire. We are getting set up here in just a minute. Uh, yeah, Ice Hero, uh, I'm personally am not seeing the Discord issue, um, but we will get you taken care of. We'll keep you posted. In fact, it looks like Ice... I saw your name earlier. I'll figure out which... You are in match B. I'll take care of you. I'll make sure you get the, uh, the, uh, the, the room code here in just a minute. Thank you, Coder. Everybody, my moderator, Coder, he'll be helping us out today. Trying to get these messages going back and forth. Put a little background music on while I stumble around here for a minute. How's everybody doing this weekend, by the way? Are you all loving the Darwin Project? Have you gotten any wins? I have, but only in private games. Absolutely, Potter Sauce. here to make sure that we've got permission to go ahead and fire up this first match today in our first match we're going to be facing off with Irvine MX Cavazon Light Yelko Zero PG Billy 57 Gafka Livel and Ice Arrow Because this is a community-based bracket, you, the community, will be voting on all the powers. I am hands-free. I will grab the powers. I will put them out there for you. And what the community does with them, that's what's going to happen. Positive. I am so glad to see you here, buddy. We are just trying to determine exactly how the brackets are going to get set up. And if we are clear to go at this point... Because the, the uh, individual private matches do have a timer to them, and we don't want to race past those. Oh, it's awesome, Mr. Good Cat. When I put an option up for um, for voting, vote buttons are going to appear right below this window. I can give you a preview of what they look like via my soundboard that I normally run. Oh, or I can push the button the wrong way and actually turn off all my connections. That's a great move. It was not kicking in. Did that really not work just now? Oh, there it's starting to kick in here. Let me try it one more time. Here is what the buttons can look like if Mixer decides to play nice today. Yeah, I saw it start to pop up too. It seems like Interactive is running a little bit slow. 
There it is. I am just a streamer. I also, <laughs> of course, you hit the button right away. <laughs> I have you. Now I gotta beat my other music. Are you the baby Jesus? These are what the buttons look like, but instead of making noises and playing sounds, they will play in the game. I'll turn that off here in just one second. Oh yeah, it's still gonna play in my headset. This is a crowd favorite for many of my streams. <laughs> but that's an idea of what the buttons are gonna look like. They're gonna pop up, they'll be giving you options to vote on who should get buffs, what zone should we move, what should we close down. I don't, Wicked, I don't know anything about it. Looks like we're ready. And... I am going to start this private match up right now. This means my eyes are off my screen. Private match. Here we go. I'm going to have to, a lot of whispers to send back and forth, guys. Also, I need to get my chat back to being my chat. There we go. That's all right, Ice Arrow. We got it all balanced out. That won't happen again. Match B. The right zone is for killing and burning only. And I promised Mr. Ice Arrow over here. There we go. I gotta make sure I get the name right. This is for match B. If you are in the tournament and you are in match B, here comes a room code for you right now. Hello, dude. Hello, how are you guys doing today? Nice and you? Doing so far so good. It is great to see you all here. Members of the community top 100. Hello, Yoke. There we go. Got people coming in slowly but surely. There we go. Six of our ten. Hey there. Hey. How to shoot? If you're asking me how to shoot, something has gone horribly wrong. Hey guys. Hello everybody. Oh, we, uh, got, we got some intense bowing going on over here. Uh, you should reopen the game. We're oh, yeah. playing in North America. Yeah. Uh, let me see so, here. So, restart the lobby. See ya. Uh, I'm double checking. Uh, I'm waiting to get well. word from, from Sam. Oh, here it comes. All right, it is confirmed. We're going to switch over to uh, a European server. This lobby is closing down. I'll get you all a new room code right away. All right, 
private match. We're going to redo this. We are switching to the European servers. Good job, Nick. That's awesome to hear. The Darwin Project is not a conspiracy. There we go. We get that up there. Ice, I know you're over here. That should get you up and running and into the room, everybody. They both. Wow. There we go. Irvine's in. here why why my eyes why are you guys excited about this match I say really. run with it coder Someone already trained in North America to perform in the final battle? Uh, I think they've said that the final matches are going to be in whatever server the majority of the players are from. Yeah. So, did you already perform in North America, guys? see people asking about stream delays usually in this game uh, especially with uh, the top 100 players here we don't have to worry too much about that um, they're all gonna be so busy trying to kill each other that stream sniping shouldn't be an issue if we feel like it is it will be addressed quarter second delay in fact good cat just another question wolf star we're playing just one round right because be we don't round. have if 10 matches the, at all. If you check the leaderboards, the scoring system is actually listed there. You'll get 10 points for finishing rank 1, uh, 7 points for rank 2, 3 points for rank 5, and so on down, down the line. I believe there's also going to be a bonus for how long people live, and a bonus point for each kill you receive. Yeah, I, I wrote this, but did we play, gonna we play one round, or even more, because we are, have done 10 matches? Yeah, no, as... As has been explained to me, it's going to be a single match, then, we'll, then I will be moving on to match D after this match is complete. Alright, still looking to get Light in here. There he is! Light is in! Alright, my friends, are we all ready to kick off yeah, the yeah. Community 100? All right, nobody's objecting. We're gonna go ahead and dive on in. Good luck, competitors. Good luck. And just like that, audience, those vote buttons should be coming active for you right now. Who do we favor in this round? Who do we like? Who do we want to say hello to first to see what's going on? 
got a pretty even spread around the map. Zero PG, you have been nominated as the crowd favorite for this round. How's that make you feel? Mm, I'm still waiting for an answer of my question. I wasn't sure I fully understood the question, and I've been juggling about three things. What's going on, my friend? We playing one round or three? Yes, one round. All right. Hello, Yelko. Ooh, I see. It. We're going to go ahead and mute the microphone so that they cannot hear me. We do have a competition going on between Yelko and Light. Light picking on Yelko right off the bat. Yelko still going ahead and harvesting that leather. They are trying to close in, making this a melee match early on. Conserving arrows, depending on the arrows they've chosen, they may not have many to spare right now. In fact, looking over Light's shoulder, we see that he is completely out of arrows at this point. Yelko, running those berserker arrows, has a couple left. Manages to catch him in a tripwire and send him falling back. Light, looking much worse for the wear. Does manage to knock Yelko back. And just like that, the RNG has also decided to spawn an electronic here, raising the stakes for this particular match. I don't think either of our competitors is likely to back down before, and they're even less likely to do so now. Light looking for Yelko to be in that tree. Can he find him? Oh, he sends Yelko from falling back. Next hit should end this fight. And there it goes. And entering the fight now comes Irvine. Light has managed to go ahead and pick up a little bit of a heal. And let's go ahead and get this taken care of right away. Gentlemen, let's go ahead and close the zone. Audience, you've got a few seconds left to tell me which zone are we going to close first. There's almost nobody hanging out over in the east zone. Headshot. But we do have a few people hanging out in the southwest. The audience, 36%, decided to close center zone. They really seem to enjoy those donut maps, making it hard for traversal for everybody. Irvine manages to take out our good friend Yelko. I'm sorry. Irvine takes out Light. That's going to be a couple bodies to loot here and some free electronics. Not to mention, he's got a good chance of picking up the electronic that was not used. So Irvine will be starting this match with two electronics. Moving over here. Hey, Levi, how you doing today? Oh, that's right. Levi already told me he did not have a microphone this round. So we're going to sit here. We're going to mock him for a minute. We're going to move on. Javanas, yes, we are indeed using director powers in this tournament, but they're not my powers. They're yours. I will not be choosing anything. I will be giving all the powers to you. In fact, audience, let me know at some point. Uh, oh, I might have coder. I'll fix that in a second. Let me know if uh, you have a power you'd like to see and when you'd like to see it. Remember, I don't have all the powers all the time. I can spend them when I want. Oh, I know you'll vote on everything. One thing I do like to do pretty early on, it's a personal quirk of mine. I like to give everybody a gravity storm. Let's get people moving. Levi sporting that moderator outfit. A new electronic is available. We haven't had a chance to check in with Gothka yet. Gothka running right up to that wall looking for some clues. Tracking down MX who is not very far away. MX, unaware other than the fact that he's got a tracking indicator. Looks like he's heading into a cabin. He is checking that map to know exactly what's coming up behind him. These are going to be weekly events. That is absolutely correct. Every week, the top 100 players in the community will be invited to join these events. And there goes the first arrow. MX and Gafka dancing around each other. MX with those fire arrows sends his competitor far, far away. Gafka coming back from the cold and closed zone over there. Looking a little bit worse for the wear. What do you think, audience? We've got a warm up. Who deserves that? Levi's got the moderator skin. That's what he's wearing right over here. Levi, my audience is fascinated by your outfit. Back to the action with MX and Gafka. Oh, here comes the warm-up to our friend Levi. Trying to get himself out of a closed zone, but also wanting that electronic. 
the low gravity making it a little easier for the next 12 seconds then he's on his own we'll check back in with Levi in a minute they are dancing in and out of that forbidden zone over here that's going to be affecting their heat levels pretty significantly gravity is back to earth levels looks like this is turning into a chase with Gafka trying to break it off MX trying to figure out where he's gone MX stopping in to check on the map I don't have word on when female characters are going to come out. Uh, if there is news officially to that, I have not seen it myself. I hope it does come out soon-ish. Next week, they've officially said that. Awesome. Southeast zone is now forbidden. Five zones Over here, we've got Kavison and Irvine starting up a fight. Blowing up some traps as they go back and forth in and out of that window. Irvine getting a parry through a window. That is an excellent shot right there. A new electronic is available. Oh, I think it's a little bit early, but with 105 of you here, do we want to see a manhunt on anybody? Let's see what you guys think here. Irvine and Cavison going at it. Cavison down, but not out. Levi. Six players remaining. Levi with that moderator outfit. You have been chosen. For those of you in the audience who are not familiar with what this does, for the next two minutes and 30 seconds, there is no hiding for our friend Levi. Wherever he goes, there's a giant beacon of light on him, and he can be seen through walls and other obstacles. Anybody who manages to kill him before this two minutes remaining timer wears out gets a giant loot case full of gear. On the other hand, if Levi can survive this two minutes all by himself, he will actually keep that gear. It's usually good for some armor, a first aid kit, and at least one electronic-based power. Ice Arrow has got his eye on Levi. He really wants to pick that up from him. Levi trying to take shelter here in the corner. Using a Boom Shroom to escape. That is an excellent way to get away. And then the zone starts to close on him. <laughs> it is a pretty tiny portion. I've uh, debated closing the box out from around my cam. Maybe in uh, future weeks, I'll take care of that. <laughs> hey, I'll tell you what, we can zero out the box. We can give it a try. Why not? I don't like floating, but if you guys are okay with it, I'm okay with it. A new electronic. 32.7. <laughs> That's a good number. It's a good number. Levi heading to the back of the zone. Going to make use of a portal. This is, means he's going to come across on the east side of the map here in just a moment. Excellent getaway strategy. And there he is coming across on the east. That means zero PG. He's got his eyes on Levi now. Is he going to close in and take that kill? I'm moving around. Four zones remaining. Four zones with five people. We got to force some more fights here. Now I do see we've got a friend who's all alone down here. Irvine all by himself in the bottom left corner. Man, only another 20 seconds. While we wait for that, let's go ahead and close out another zone. The arrows begin to fly. Ten more seconds and Levi gets to keep his loot. Although if he loses his life, it just is going to go over to his competitor anyway. Here a PG teleporting away. And we have opted to close. Up here, we've got another fight brewing in the Ewok Village. MX versus Ice Arrow. We've got another competitor on the edge. Boom Shrooms are being used to get some quick move, movement and mobility here as this zone is starting to close out. Oh, is that what we think? All right. You know what? That power is going to become active right about now. There's a suggestion on the table to nuke the Northwest Zone, which is where many of these competitors are trying to get to as we speak. What do you guys think? Is that a good idea? Let's see what happens. 
Interference is the name of the game with Darwin Project. That's why they put these powers in. 73% of the people watching right now agree we should close out the Northwest Zone. That means these two have got about uh, 30 seconds to either end this fight and get away or suffer the wrath. They can, of course, play it safe. Good fight, guys. They can, of course, play it safe. It is possible to dive into the closed zone and uh, take a little bit of that cold damage in exchange for surviving a nuke. It looks like that's the plan here for Iced Arrow. Well, we don't have to worry too much, Potter Sauce, about, about people who are poor players who aren't very good at the game, because this is, after all, the community top 100. They are used to the interference from the director. Over here, we've got Irvine get, hanging out by a campfire and watching the map, trying to figure out where his next target is going to be. Meanwhile, an electronic has just spawned behind him. He's going right for it. Oh, and that's a wrong button there. Being moderator Levi, following the footprints, trying to figure out where his target is. Southwest zone is about to be forbidden. What do you think? Should we give somebody a speed up, ladies and gentlemen? Levi, seeing that trap thanks to his radar. Meanwhile, his prey has taken off with a teleport. Can he find zero PG? Irvine, it looks like they got tired of you being all by yourself down here. They have given you a speed up to help you get out of dodge. Back to the hunt. Levi closing in on zero PG. Zero PG knows he's coming though, setting up the field a little bit to his advantage, trying to figure out which way he's going to be coming from. Southwest zone is now forbidden. Two zones remaining. Ice Arrow picking up another electronic. Really interesting to note here that Ice Arrow has quite a full complement of goods at his disposal. He's got a hot coffee, so he doesn't need any more fires. He's got himself not one, not two, but three health kits. Oh, but he gets tripped up in a trap. That is going to let the entire map know where he is for the next 30 seconds or so. We have four competitors filling up two zones. They are still awfully spread out. <laughs> nice. My firebot actually took care of that, but you are absolutely right. Thank you, Hayes. Coder, can you clean that up a little bit if you have a second? Ice Arrow leaving his fire out there. Zero PG trying to get those sniper shots down on his opponent. Looks like he's going to be trying to stick himself into the woods. The next zone closure could be a big influencer. Let's go ahead and put a no new electronic down. This is one thing I can't actually put down. Oh, that was you? Sorry. I just got it. I got the message from the system. Hey, Fire Bottle. How you doing? Queen Chris. Good to see you guys. A new electronic. There is a new electronic in play. It is on the border right between our two remaining zones. Meanwhile, Irvine falls into Zero PG's tripwire. Zero PG using those traps to great effect, but Irvine not going to keep himself held down, immediately tossing out that smoke bomb to lose that tracking information. And the computer has decided to go ahead and close the zone with the most people in it. That leaves Levi over here in really good position. If he can capitalize on this, this could be a big game changer for him. Levi does have a good number of traps in his inventory. He could start setting the field as he sees fit. At the moment, he's just going to build a fire and bide his time, it looks like. Ah, 
Ice Arrow trying to get that electronic. He is halted. It looks like that shot came from... I can almost figure out. Zero PG perhaps took that shot, although I would have expected it to come from Levi. Ice Arrow keeping himself in a hut. Undoubtedly reading a map right now to try and get the lay of the land. Levi still hanging out by his fire. Half advertising where he is, but half keeping hidden. Here comes Irvine closing in on the zone. Tell Narmo, it's my understanding that they don't have the plan set in stone yet for what we're going to do for Xbox, but they are in planning to do something in the coming weeks to help the uh, Xbox community because we are big fans of you guys as well. Good cat. I've seen players do that. Just completely litter a zone with traps. The fight is happening in and out of the cabin here. Irvine and Ice Arrow are going at it pretty viciously, diving and rolling. Nobody seems to be able to score that important hit right now, and away goes Irvine trying to get himself some better footing. Levi still dancing around the edges trying to figure out when the best time is going to be to engage. He's going to try to play the casual route. He wants to get in there. He wants to he wants to be the survival. It is, after all, Darwin Project. It is not about fighting fair. It is about being the last survivor in the game. Hero PG also circling at the far edges of the fight. And in just a few seconds here, we should see sudden death kick in. At that point, this zone will start to shrink and contract. We have four people. Sudden death. We have four people in a very tight zone, and here comes the zone closure as we speak. And just like that, Zero finds himself outside the match. Goes back in down here. Levi is still doing some work. Irvine. These players are not going to be able to stay separated a whole lot longer. The map is drawing them all together. Zero PG. Looks like you might even be eyeing an electronic up here. Oh, and here's the fight we've been waiting on. Ice Arrow taking a run. Levi triggering his radar as well. Everybody's trying to get all that important knowledge about where everybody else is. Ice Arrow finds himself getting two hits and outside the closing zone. A headshot from Irvine takes him out of the match. Levi trying to close in as well. More radar reports back and forth. Irvine and Levi are going at it at this point. Levi turning on his camouflage to stay hidden. Irvine setting up a tripwire behind himself as Zero PG hops into a cabin. Avery's trying to find that great position they need here. Starting in those fires. Zero G with his energy shield active. They are going to be bouncing each other around, and meanwhile, Irvine biding his time on the edge. There goes Levi. Irvine tripping over Zero PG's tripwire. That's going to let the whole map know where he is. Zero PG hanging out on the edge. Irvine with a bear trap under his feet, trying to bait people into it. He sees Zero PG. He hits him with an arrow, knocking him into the cold zone of the closure. They are chasing each other around and around. Nobody wants to give up any ground on this. They're all playing super cautiously as those walls still continue to close in nice and slow. It is worth mentioning that, yes, this will be a weekly event for the foreseeable future. We will be seeing more of these events. So if you can finish in the top 100 this week, you could be featured in the community battles next week as well. Oh, right into that trap, letting everybody know right where he is. Levi taking that shot. Activating his camouflage. The walls. We have reached the maximum here, I think. Nope, those walls are still sneaking in just a little bit. They will eventually hit a halting point, but we're not there just yet. Cannot believe that we are 19 minutes into this match and we still have three competitors going at it. Nobody wants to give up that precious ground. They're all looking to score that full 10 points they're going to get for finishing the match. Uh-oh. There it goes. Irvine taken out of the match. Leaving us with just our final two. Both Levi and Zero PG looking pretty good. Zero PG taking another hit from an arrow. He's forced to stay outside, and Levi takes it. Ten points for our new friend Levi.
whose name I think I've been butchering this whole match. The zones do not shrink down to zero. They do have a final stopping point. It's close. It's tight. But there we go. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the first round here on Mixer of the Top Community 100 Week 1. We will be setting up here in just a few minutes for Match D. If you are watching and you are in Match D, stay tuned in the Discord channel. I will be letting everybody know what the private match room number is going to be in just a moment. Gotta get myself a sip of water. If you want to see how your uh, favorite players did, you can check out the uh, leaderboard. Coder, if it hasn't popped up in a while, can you please go ahead and put out a uh, leaderboard code for me, please? Oh, right. I got to fix that real quick while I'm here. Da, 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 permission everyone. Hmm. Nope. I see what I did. EDP leaderboard. Edit. Huh. Yeah, it says everybody. You may punt the deer in your name. TDP. But do TDP. The Darwin, Darwin Project. All right, I'm hopping over to the Discord. Match D has been posted to the Discord channel. We are going to be looking at Vic TV, Branch Mort Twitch, Funere, whose name I know I butcher every time you I say it. You know me, Nouvelle, and STQN, Dragomato, Furric, WR, and 72 Hours Student. People are trickling in already. Hello, everybody. Hello, guys. Super glad to see you all here. Yo, yo, yo. Hello, guys. Hello everyone, how's it going today? Going super Hello. well, we're glad to have you here. Hello, Welcome. hello Funera. Blackmore. What's Where is your edge? <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> Brush. Brush. Brush more. Let's see who we're missing here, everybody. We got Vic. We got Brant. Ray. Nomia. Nouvelle's on their way. SDQN is here.
Hey, how about we all go in the middle and we just dance? <laughs> yeah, let's dance. But who's gonna boombox for us? Smile for the camera. Smile for the camera. There it is. For those of you who are here in the lobby, if you haven't already heard, the we will still be using our director powers, but 100% of their effectiveness will be decided by the people watching on Mixer. Okay. Who are we missing now? There it is. We've got everybody in. We've got people making their uh, favorite uh, predictions here in the Mixer chat. Hayes Sana says that he refused to cheer for Drago Mato because he got slaughtered so badly last time he encountered him. All right, guys. Looks like we're all here. Are we ready to begin the match? Go. All right. You know how this Let's is played. Go. We'll remember survival of fittest. We'll see you on the other side. Good luck, up front. Good luck, guys. Good luck. Good luck. Have fun. And for those of you watching right now, you should have vote buttons right below my video window. Tell me who your crowd favorite is. Why not, Mixer? We've also got a stream going over on Twitch with Sing Vogel. She's directing uh, half the matches and I'm directing the other half. Vic TV with 10 votes. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my fucking god. They love <laughs> thank you, you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Everyone. We are expecting really big things out of you this round, Vic. You got anything you want to say before I leave you alone? Uh, I, I can't say anything, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite say. all right. I don't know what to say. Funera, you are the second most popular player this round. I've got several people rooting for you in my chat. How's that make you feel? <laughs> what? How do you feel? Uh, stressed. I'm so stressed. <laughs> we understand. <laughs> I won't bother you too long then. WR, how you doing today? Yep, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Excellent. We're glad to hear that. STQN, how do you feel about your chances today? Uh, it will be very hard, I think. It should but be, but try. we expect a really good fight out of you guys today. Yeah, I hope. <laughs> a new you know, Mia, how you doing? Hey, I'm good. How about you? We are doing excellent. We are really expecting a great match today. I can't wait to see that, my dude. All right. Thanks for checking on me. Rank Mort, how you doing? Fine and you, man. We're doing real well. Checking out that Ewok village, huh? Good luck over there. Drago up on the roof, looting those chests right away. How you doing, buddy? Oh, we're gonna move on. We got a fight happening. And over here, we've got a fight ready to brew. You know me, laying down some traps. Not able to catch his competitor in it. 72 hours closing in on him, taking out that tripwire without any delay. Boom, getting that hit in on Eunomia. Two hits. Oh, there it goes. Uh, first kill of the round. 72 hour student getting that free electronic for getting that first blood. If you are not seeing the votes come up, Oh yeah, most people call it Ewok Village. If you don't see the votes come up, wait for another one. They oftentimes refresh by themselves. Or go ahead and refresh the stream. That should produce those voting buttons you're looking for. In the meantime, audience, I have a plethora of powers. What should I do first? Do we want to see an early manhunt? Do we want to go ahead and close some zones? We've got another fight brewing as we sit here. Let's get up out of the way of our competitors. So to our student is facing up against Nouvelle. Oh, and that red burst tells me that we've got yet another person closing in on this match. This could be a great zone to close. Oh, if you want to see a zone closure happen already, I'm going to put it to you guys. It's not up to me what we close. This is a community match. You, the community members, decide what's going to happen in there. Student trying to get that better here on Novell. Both Student and Nouvelle looking a little worse for the wear. One more hit could close this out for a Student. Oh. Student's going to go ahead and try to make a break for it. Center zone is going to be closed at this point per audience vote. Arrow kill. Humera over here stuck in the middle. Gonna have to close out. Oh, and there goes that fight. Arrow kill. Arrow kills happening everywhere. Nouvelle got a hit. Closing out that round.
Got Dragomato closing in on Furic. Furic starting that fire here. Making himself a beacon, but not going to be fooled by it. Was watching that map. Sees Dragomato coming. Dragomato looking for an escape path. Using his teleport power to get away. Furic grabbing up every last arrow he can on his way to go ahead and close that back out. Here, take a moment to study that map. Drago hasn't given up yet. He's got himself up, perched up well up high. Waiting to see what's going to happen with Furyk. Waiting for Furyk to come out. Oh, that's true. If you are watching on Xbox or on mobile, you will have to push a button when the uh, interactive abilities come live. We're going to go ahead and drop a gravity storm on the map. I like to give all the competitors a chance to get moving around. A chance to traverse the zones. Over here, we've got Nouvelle in the middle of a closing zone, chosen by the computer and not by the community. Back to the... Ooh, hiccups. This is a much bigger stream. How you doing, Ionic? This is the official... One of two official community top 100 streams going on right now. The other one is being hosted over on Twitch TV by Sing Vogel. It's good to see you here again, my friend. The competitors in these matches are the people who have uh, who placed in the top 100 for the first week of this game being in early access. They were all given an invitation to join this match and we paired them up into various uh, divisions. And now we're seeing the results of that action. Furyk walking right into a trap laid by Dragomato as Dragomato waited in a tree. Furyk quick to respond, knocking him back. A new electronic is available. Both of our competitors trying to get a good view of the other. You didn't fail us, you know me. You're still a winner in our hearts. You just may not be a survivor. Zone closure request. I can honor that. What do you guys want to see closed? We've got two people. We've got three people dancing around here in the Northeast. That's a likely candidate. Four people have just shown up thanks to a teleport, I think. No, there was a fight going on. There it is. Furic manages to take out Dragomato, and the audience has voted to close this zone. That's not going to be too much of a hindrance here. But over here, we've got Brackmort. Brackmort, Unomia says that he's sorry he failed us, but he's rooting for you at this point. Now we've just got to see if you can get out of this zone all by yourself. Audience, do you think he deserves uh, a little assistance in getting out? Or should we give this speed up to somebody else? He is trying to take advantage of those boom shrooms to get some maximized traversal. Meanwhile, we've got another fight brewing over here. Oh, and we did! The audience has spoken. They want oh. Brackmore to get out of the zone. A new electronic is available. This is going to prove interesting because there are other people waiting right on that zone. You want to see a nuke? I don't have the power for a nuke just yet, but I like the way you think, Telnarno. Telnarmo! Tel My voice will eventually work. Oh, and we've got another one going on over here. WR and Nouveau trading hits. Oh, his radar lets him know that there is a trap waiting for him there. Will he be able to stay away from it, or is he going to close in anyway? He is going to go ahead and take the advantage of the moment to grab some arrows. Duvel staying near his trap, actually picking it up and moving with it. I've heard a request for a nuke. Let's go ahead and see if we can harass everybody with a nuke. We've got two people dancing down here in the southwest, three more in the northwest. Ults, this is exactly why we love the Darwin Project. It is all up to you guys, the fate of our competitors. Southeast. Looks like these two are going to split it off. Nuke that nuke is going to go ahead and go off up to the side here. Let's go see what's going on over this way. Mork, you are, I'm sorry, Brackmort, you are on the wrong end of so many of these closures. How you doing, buddy? Fine. You got this, right? A little bit stressed, but... <laughs> That's okay. 
We ex You're a survivor, man. You've got this. <laughs> Oh, and the fight rages on here. WR and Nouvelle both trying to get the better angle on each other. That tracking information going away. Nouvelle trying to hightail it out. Trying to stay behind a post. Trying to drain each other of arrows, it looks like. Also taking great advantage of trying to lay a bunch of traps. WR is not going to fall for that. There is so much more coming, Hayes, Sana. I can't even talk about some things that I've heard are coming. Oh, and there it goes. WR gets the hit on Nouvelle, taking him out. Arrow kill. And another arrow kill has just been placed. Our two-way fight became a arrow kill. Some of the announcements are being delayed. That's throwing me off a little bit. Eric and Funera closing in on each other, circling around. What do you think, guys? Should I throw an electronic down in the area? There is an electronic spot right here in the corner of this map. We can just put this right here. Do we want to give them, uh, do we want to raise the stakes? I'm seeing that we should raise the stakes. That's what I'm hearing from you guys. Do it. Go for boy. Good to see you, my friend. Raising the stakes, making this fight a little bit more important. Funera trying to grab that. Fury knows it's coming. Repels him. Shooting the computer directly like that. WR, they're, they're feeling a little bad for you being so far away down here. Yeah, I'm, I'm going for them. All right. Oh, no. We missed the headshot at the last second. Arrow kill. Funera going in to pick that up. Two players remaining. Wisely checking the map, trying to see where his competition is. Staying right on the edge of these zones. Both of our remaining competitors are staying here. They are almost, they are both, as far as I can tell, at full health. They're both keeping warm. We don't have a lot of influence we can apply at this point. About the only thing we have left, I could activate a manhunt, but uh, I think that that's only because of a current bug. I don't think that's meant to be the case right now. One second away, and sometimes you look away and you miss all the fun, Hazed. Nera using that radar pulse. He is not going to get any information on WR's location. Northwest WR, on the other hand, going after that activated. remaining electronic. Two zones remaining. Get up above the action. Give ourselves a bird's eye view of what's going on. They are both closing in on that electronic. This should be interesting to watch. Looks like WR is going to take the long way around. He may feel that that electronic is bait. We are indeed down to the final two competitors here for match D. WR taking a shot at Funera. He's seen him. He's taking off. Is he going to let Funera get this electronic? WR coming up to try and stop him. Is he going to be able to make the shot in time is the question. Oh, Funera gets it and gets away. Building himself a camouflage. Funera taking the sneaky route. Push him away from west. I am out of powers for pushes. About all I have left that would have really helped these two. Let's see who your favorite is. Who are we going to give a warm up to? There is a warm-up on the table, and the arrows start flying. Funera quickly taking out WR's armor, and on the juggle, hitting him with an arrow. WR returning that favor. Knocking each other back from the bush in a parry, and Funera again with that juggle. Never giving him a chance to slow down. WR coming in with that free warm-up. The audience saw that he was the frostier of the two competitors. Both of them trying to get a bead on the other. Using his power leap, he clears the tower, trying to figure out exactly where WR is gone. WR, in the meantime, low to the ground, trying to keep under cover. He knows he's at a hit point disadvantage here. Two more hits, and it's all over for WR. Oh, and here comes Funera. He found him hiding out in that tree. 
WR trying to keep downhill so that making those arrows a lot less effective. WR waiting for Funera to come down the hill after him. Biding his time. How long will he wait? Sudden step. Oh, and with that, it is sudden death. The walls begin to close in on our competitors at this point. Funera hits WR's tripwire. That's going to give WR some vision on him for the next few seconds. Funera opening up an arena, trapping himself inside. Oh, Funera with an, with an arrow shot takes him out. Rick9 here on uh, Mixer. You don't actually need a plug-in. Uh, that is necessary over on Twitch TV, but we don't use it over on this end. That looked at first from the angle we were at, Ascender, that looked like it was an arena, but I think we were actually just seeing the sudden death walls closing in. I misreported that. Oh, yeah. I, you know what, Tell Narmo, I personally don't like to use um, Gravity Storm on the very last fight. That's just not the way I like to run it. Personally, when I'm show directing, I like to run those uh, early on in the match. I like to see the players have a chance to move around. Uh, some of the start points in the game can be a little bit rough to navigate. You know, you might have high walls. You might have to go through some caves. Gravity Storm gives you a chance to kind of circumvent a lot of that. Get to where you want to be. Gives people a chance to pick up more resources, which I think leads to better fights later on. Plus, who doesn't like Gravity Storm when you're not in the middle of a fight? This is a chance for people to get in bounce around, get some freedom of movement before they have to uh, encounter somebody. If they run into each other out there once it's going, no blame on me. I don't know, Balon. When I'm an inmate, I like Gravity Storm if I'm not in a fight. Once I'm in a fight, uh, my opinion varies a little bit. Stay tuned, everybody. We may be having a match F. I'm waiting to see uh, what, the, what the word is here. Waiting to see what the word is. I'd like to remind everybody that uh, we are also, if you're looking for more action, over on Twitch TV, Sing Vogel's channel. I'll get you all a link for her right away. She is actually just starting match C right now. Let me grab you her link as well. If you were looking to see the uh, ongoing events in another match, go check that one out right now while I wait to see uh, what we're going to be doing over here with Match F in just the next few minutes. Ah, uh, we can't always get what we want, Francis Francisco. All right, there is going to be a match F. Oh, I see it. I scroll down a little bit, and here it comes. I see one. I see names starting to populate that list. Let me refresh my view of the bracket here. E match F. We do have another match about to start here. I'm just giving the details of what I need to set up directly from the scavengers team. So there was some talk here a minute ago about what, you know, the divisiveness of uh, Gravity Storm. What powers would you add or remove? If you were in charge of the director, if we gave you a blank slate, what powers would you add to the director's repertoire? What powers would you remove? How would you change things up? That is absolutely correct, Falcon Impulse. Sing Vogel, awesome streamer, great show director. Be sure to check her stream out while we're waiting here. All of them. You can do that via private matches. I uh, personally disagree. I think that it's part of what makes Darwin Project such a unique game. But not everybody loves the director. That's understandable. 
And I'm going to counter that one too, Tep. <clears throat> I've watched people get some really impressive shots in the middle of a gravity storm. Being able to predict those longer arcs and the way people drift and move, not to mention the fact that people can kind of steer a bit up there in the air, I think that adds another element of skill, and, and uh, you have to be able to have the foresight to figure out where your targets are going to be. All right, we are receiving the list here of who we're doing, of who's going to be in uh, match F, and that looks to me like that's mostly EU. All right, we're going to be going ahead and starting up another match right now, everybody. Echo side of gravity storm, especially when it comes to using bubbles to protect yourself. Absolutely. Or, as I often make the mistake of doing, if you hit that uh, power leap right as the uh, gravity storm hits, because you don't know it's coming, that can be real fun. It's about uh, 10 minutes till you hit the ground again. <laughs> All right. Looks like we're going to be facing MDOS, Midget, Par Infinity, Milky Way X, Blixtman, KYC, Frenzy, Kirilov, and Icy Caress. I'm going to be letting those players know right now that we're setting up for match F. for the official player tournament scoreboard to get changed. If a drone camera is in front of you, remember to smile, but do not wave as it may confuse the motion sensor. Good discussion going on here about what's going on and what powers people do and don't like. I would disagree again, Falcon Impulse. It's all about a choice. Invincibility does give you that protection for about 10 seconds. It also lets you run through traps. Not a lot of people know that. But the risk is, especially the sudden death situation, that you do face that knockback that can put you right into a closed zone. It's all about choices and all if about your options. Is in the future, your family will receive proportional to your screen time at a rate of five coins per All right, we've got people coming in. We've got Midget and Twitch KYC joining the match. Milky Way, good to hear you Midget? laughing and joining the match. You, man? <laughs> Dude, I shoot my bow and it goes off three <laughs> seconds later. <laughs> oh no! How many things do you have? 350. <laughs> oh no. Well, that's not three, three but seconds. That's, that's a third Australian. of a second. That's still Fuck. a big deal. <laughs> good luck hitting me, though. That's the fun part. <laughs> Bro, y'all done me dirty. <laughs> All right, the room is starting to populate. I'm gonna double check the list here. Can keep sure track of the leaderboards. Jump in the lava, like holy shit! You can keep track of the leaderboards. <laughs> Who's going to be in what matches and how people are scoring as these right, games progress so how, by checking that link how right there. Hey. Oh no, not you, man! Here they I come! I love you, buddy! No, I don't like I've you, already man. won a tournament today, by the way. Uh, <laughs> I won Monka's <laughs> tournament earlier, and that was on the and that was on the US server. Why am I on the EU server? Sorry, I'm sorry. Why are you Sam told me to put you on a real server. Why are you on an EU server, bitch? You know, I'll take it, I guess, but <laughs> I'll be ready. I won't. Yeah, uh, end off. Put it this way. At least you got in. 
Okay. <laughs> so many it is great to hear all these yeah, players because they've all failed with each other in various <laughs> matches. Uh, they know what they're doing. Dude, I'm gonna have to like hit someone with my axe three seconds later. There's some right history now. here. <laughs> I'm gonna. I don't know if I should try hard or if I should just, you know, eh, I don't know. try okay. hard uh, and then go back to yeah. chatting. And Looking at the hundred. lobby, how the lobby is running, I think I might be okay. But boy, I it could change a lot. How many people here? I'm are not okay. I'm trying to figure out uh, who we're missing. From yeah, I have a, I have 120 of you. ping. Who, who, oh, 120, that's I have, so I have 200. bad. I have 63. I mean, I'm from EUE. Oh. I'm from NA East, dude. I'm used to like 30. 63? <laughs> oh man, I feel so bad for you having <laughs> like, a little bit higher. Well, you're probably 63. We are two of the kind, history. violent, unsound of mind. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that, now, that ladies and gentlemen, I have an announcement to make. <laughs> the first person I kill will be worn around my neck as a lovely bracelet. <laughs> Don't ask why my neck has a bracelet. It doesn't matter, because it's going to be fun. <laughs> uh, Second uh, person, yeah. their foot gets put under my bed. I'll call it uh, my lucky foot. It'll be brilliant. Uh, are you in the direct? And then the third person, your hand gets stuck on my wall. So I can high five you whenever I make a joke. <laughs> <laughs> my audience is eating it up, I see caress. Sorry, what was that move? <laughs> Bella! I said I'm my really audience cool. is eating up the performance. Oh, are they? Cool. They're <laughs> loving it. My Brussels! It's not cool! It's not cool! Just waiting on... <laughs> curly off! Filthy! Dirty little hobbitses! I muted for half a second. I'm trying, Bella. I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> Ooh, I like what that. What a one cunt! Right? Holy shit! Give people an option, give them a bonus <laughs> for entering the zone. Am I right now? Yikes. 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 <laughs> Nah, I, I've been, I've had a weird day today, and I haven't had a chance to do my voices all day, so I'm just getting it all out in the lobby. <laughs> if I start chasing after you in game, going, I'm going to eat you. I, I apologize in advance. Okay. Sometimes being a good director means knowing when to shut up and just let them go. <laughs> we are waiting on one more player. I'm trying to find Curly off. I kind of wish I had the stream up to read the chat, but I don't think that would be very fair. <laughs> uh, and and, hey, and making that even worse is that being a mixer stream, I'm running on a quarter second delay, so it's pretty much real time. Oh, is it? It Hello, is! Hello, everyone! Welcome to the real time! <laughs> Yo, we'll start. We'll start. What, what uh, led you to stream on Mixer instead of uh, Twitch? So I started on Twitch. I spent a couple years there. I heard about Beam. I checked it out. I liked the community. I liked the fact that back then it only had a three second delay versus the 10 or so I always saw on Twitch. And then they turned yeah, on Twitch this new feature called FTL, Faster Than Light. And I don't know what I would do with anything over a quarter second delay at this point. That's kind of nuts. Hmm. How about a full second delay in game from your arrow shooter? So, I'm getting reports to try and move on, my camera. Casey, Bailon, really I can <laughs> move my camera. I'll be covering up the mini-map at that Swing point, at however. Swing at me! Stop trying to hit me and hit me! <laughs> hey, there's the dodge. Nicely done, sir. You're gonna kick my ass. Oh, well, good. No, Sam's well, well, wait, Thank you, Sam. Long, Mr. Director. I thought this shit was better organized. Motherfuckers ain't got no going on here. Wait, hang on. Are you uh, safe for work, Wolfstar? I'm sorry, what was that? Are, are you safe for work? Uh, no, I am actually a mature rated stream. Cool. These motherfuckers ain't got shit going on. <laughs> I want this shit start. <laughs> Looks like we're not getting a response from Curly Off. Sam is looking to see if we can get any other seats to fill up these positions here. Okay. Uh, if I crash, I apologize. I need to tap out for a second. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna crash. God damn it. Fuck! Stupid! I'll be back. Give me a second. Right, right. You've got uh, 11 minutes. Wow, 
fire arrows is a uh, bait for new players. What did you say? Fire arrows are a bait for new players. I think Midjet is gonna win. I have an idea. The audience Instead of camo, I'm gonna blood. start because that's the only damage I'm ever gonna we, use. We can. That's we the can only damage I can hit. Full ten if we can. <laughs> Noted, Coder. I'm waiting for permission. I was gonna use We've got dude. the uh, scavenger team but... looking to fill uh, two more people in here real quick before we call it a day. And we. I don't think we gotta hit anything. Like... We launch the game. <laughs> I don't know. This. This. Uh, I was playing EU, dude. Gotta be honest. All right, Trick Loss is joining in. I don't understand if if my if I'm one in my boat first, how can the other person shoot me before him? Be before I shoot him. That's my question. At the moment, I'm That's shooting true. and I'm we able to run actually, before if you're, the arrow If you're comes Jones right now, I don't want you to leave me. But if you have the ability to run more than one browser window, like go ahead and watch twitch.tv slash x sing vocal x. They're in the middle of a tournament uh, uh, round as we speak. Faster. I can no, never touch no, that. No, no, none of you is French. Bottom left, bottom right. You want me to move to bottom right? Not I can me. move All myself right. to bottom All right. right. Let's do this. Speak me in French, please. I'll come over here. Hello. I think I'm sure you'll be blocking something. We'll see what comes up. Oh, 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 oh hey, we got full lobby now. Yeah. 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 We'll try this yeah. out. Yeah. All right, yeah, Mr. Wolf Star. Yes, it looks like we have yeah. filled up the match. Are you all ready? Cause it. Okay, so raise um, your hand if you're not here. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Okay, we're all here. Let's go. Let's go. Everyone having fun. Yeah, how's it going, dude? It's going well. How are you? Yeah, I'm having trouble getting right. my uh, chat to scroll because the game refuses to let go of my mouse. So we'll start here with you. All right, that's that's cool. Crowd favorite voting is about to finish up. Milky Way, you have stolen crowd yeah. favorite icy caress. We didn't expect it. Yeah, not at all. Man, I I'm hope French. you enjoy the confetti. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, you gonna take this round? Is it all you? Uh, I, mean, I think I'm gonna lose. Oh, uh, everybody here I'm is a winner. Watch. The question is whether or not you can survive. Uh, I, uh, I don't think so, man. <laughs> we believe I'm, in you I'm anyway, French. Milky Way. Uh, I'm living in South France. Oh, fantastic. Well, we expect good things out of you, my friend. Thank you, man. Icy Caress, it was a close vote. You were almost crowd favorite. Mm -hmm. Oh, Hang he's on. trying to be I'm quiet. Chasing someone. You got it. We will go radio silent over here while he does his thing. Let's check in on some other people who are close to a fight. We've got Frenzy, who appears to be closing in on Trick Loss. I do see the request over here that we might want to do a manhunt on him later. Is that true? What does the audience think about triggering a manhunt early in the game? Usually in the first uh, couple minutes is when I like to go ahead and launch a gravity storm. But if we want to do a manhunt instead, I'm open to that suggestion. You just have to let me know what you want to see. These are community rounds. It's up to you. Meanwhile, over here, it looks like Icy Caress is in a fight already with Par Infinity. He's got those hunter arrows, so he knows right where Par Infinity is trying to hide. Our video try to keep him on his toes. Get up above the match a little bit, ladies and gentlemen. See what we can see from up above. Besides the name bug that I get from time to time. Icy Caress putting an arrow into Par Infinity. That is 300 points of damage he's dealt so far with those arrows. Icy Caress is also taking a hit himself. Oh, there it goes. Icy Caress earning that first blood. That means he's got a free electronic to build whatever blood. he wants with. Blood! Oh, I love it so much. <laughs> oh, let me paint in your flesh. <laughs> we got to go check in on a three-way fight. We'll be back. Oh, we got here just in time to miss the kill. 
but it's not over. Not by a long shot. There comes Frenzy out of the bush. Blixtman trying to get a bead on him, and not far away, a, a new electronic is forming. Now, audience, I heard we wanted an early manhunt. Is that true? Let me get a... Can I get a show of hands? Who wants an early manhunt? Oh, there they come. I got one no, but I've got three yeses. Go, go, go. The votes say yes. Who are we going to manhunt right out the gate? Neither of our competitors here seem to have anything to say about it. Any volunteers? Put it on this guy that I'm fighting, please. Ah, please. Ha, ha, ha. Fuck that, man. Oh. Milky Way. The crowd Why? is fickle. You've gone no. from favorite to manhunted. No. Oh! <laughs> and the gentleman who you beat out. Why are you the one I'm hunting next? <laughs> the two crowd Get favorites on, facing man. off against each other. Oh, my friend. Why are you running? Just let me eat you. I want to consume your beautiful white flesh. Your beautiful <laughs> chocolatey goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Coming in for those accents. Milky managed to break his armor. Give it all to me. Sending him flying back oh, with yeah, a nice axe hit. <laughs> Can you just stop running and let me get <laughs> these sweet, sweet hits in? No. Stop running. That's what my favorite requests to make. They never listen, oh, though. Jeez, is that tree solid? Whoa. Nice shark. <laughs> Icy oh, never standing oh, still, never arms. letting him get a solid oh, beat. Does stop to pick up oh, those arrows, up. though. Icy Caress, one hit yeah, from the I'm, loss I'm, here. I'm Milky <laughs> Way, two hits oh, remaining <laughs> before he's losing his life. I need help. No. Oh, I yes. hear a request for health. Do we want to throw a heal on the map, ladies stop and gentlemen? Stop running! You coward! Got another fight happening also in the northeast zone. Oh, this is close. Come on, come on, final arrow. It's coming down to this. The next hit will take it. Will Mookie Way be able to keep his uh, manhunt prize, or is it going to go to Icy no! Caress? Mookie yes! Way takes out Icy <laughs> Caress. <laughs> Very well played, sir. Very heal well now. Played. The vote is coming in for a heal. I agree with you. I'm gonna die. Are we gonna give it to Mookie Way and help him survive this manhunt we've imposed on him? He's only gonna survive for another 30 seconds, and he gets to keep all the prizes for himself. He has no idea if there are other people near him oh, or not. There it is. The audience has rained favor on Milky Way. Let's go check in with uh, other people. Over here, KYC trying to close in. He's got 15 seconds to get the kill. <laughs> I'm not going to make that. <laughs> He's not going to make that. We're going to go check in with a fight. Meanwhile, over here, this fight continues. Blixman versus Frenzy. We left you guys like three minutes ago when you were fighting. I think we've got too many zones. What are we going to close off, ladies and gentlemen? The whole north and west barely even being used. We've got a couple people dancing around where we're sitting right now here in the west zone. A couple people all the way in the east as well. East zone has been voted to be closed. Milky Way, they can't decide if they love or hate you. What? They, they gave you the manhunt, then they give you the heal. They give you the crowd favorite, now they close your zone. It's a very fickle audience yeah. we've got today. Yeah, uh, you, have, you have a strange, uh, very strange chat, man. We, we want to help you get around a little bit better. Uh, I've got a request for up. this. Oh, no. Why? <laughs> got a new fight developing over here. M. Dos versus Midget. Bro, this is unfit. Shots are going back and forth. Both of them taking full advantage of the terrain and the gravity storm as best they can. Amdos dropped behind Midget trying to get that axe hit in. Oh, he goes through a tripwire, giving Midget exactly information of where he is. Let's sneak inside with him. West zone is now forbidden. Both of them trying to get the upper hand on the Five other. A clever move here by a midget, putting the tripwire through the house, giving him another hit on 
Oh my goodness, he manages to get that How did I hit that with 300 feet? <laughs> Oh, and somebody else steals the kill. We've got a lot of people building up in one zone. I know what I would do with this power. What are you going to do with it, audience? Uh-oh, Milky Way stepping into that tripwire from Midget. Slayer of Legends, it should be showing up if you're watching on the web right below my video window automatically. If you're watching on Xbox or on mobile, you will have to push the interactive button to see the vote buttons when they come up. Just watch me to open up my control panel, and when you see me selecting a power, know that you're getting a chance to vote right away at that point. Blackific hanging out here in the nuke zone. Meanwhile, we can see all the other icons scattering. Like cockroaches. Trying to find the best angle to get out. <laughs> Gravity returning was... normal as he bounces off a tree. Is he going to get clear? That was not. That was. Yeah. We're not we didn't talk see about that. anything. As far as I know, that was a perfect pass. We're not we saw talk about none that. of it. <laughs> KYC all alone up here. All alone. <laughs> he could build a nice summer cottage, hang out. It does work on mobile Falcon Impulse. It, it requires you to open a different screen while you're watching, so it's it's a little sloppy, but it works. We got a few players who are looking cold. Audience, I'm putting up another vote. Who are we gonna warm up? Milky Way and Blixman are the coldest. KYC all alone by himself here could use a little bit of warm-up, but Lakafic isn't exactly hot either. Who are we gonna give? Who gets the love? Milky Way, they decided you looked a little Thank bit you. chilly over here. Yes, I am. I All the powers, good and bad, have been coming your way this round. Audience, I have a proposal. I can't put this up for a proper vote, but all the way up there in that northeast zone, I could drop an electronic. Do we try and bait people? You know, Noob Investor, I'm a big fan of Mixer. I've been here for three years. I really like the default automatic way that the buttons pop up instead of having to run a plug-in. But you're right. I really do like the way it pops up and shows on an overlay as opposed to coming up as buttons beneath the screen. Perfect world. I'd love to see Mixer have that and the instantaneous uh, everything else they've got going on right now. Coder is running a poll right now. If you go ahead and vote on that, should we drop an electronic in the north east north west zone? I take that back. Uh oh, midget doing some damage to KYC. Winner says yes. We're gonna go ahead and drop that electronic over here in the northwest zone. The show director Let's see if we can bait some people over. Oh, and into the cottage he comes, getting his hit with an axe right away, taking time to get that shot in, repelling midget with a hit. KYC. Oh, traps upon traps. They've trapped each other, but <laughs> KYC managed to take Midget out. <laughs> oh my god. An hour to loot that body. <laughs> traps upon traps. <laughs> Audience, we've got four people, three zones. Let's get two people to a zone. Go ahead and close one more for me. Oh, it is a mega trap match. Show director is now closing a zone. Blixman and Lakafic both trading tripwires and traps back and forth. That knockdown, Blixman taking full advantage of it. Lakafic taking another arrow. Both of our competitors are pretty evenly matched in health. Let's see how they can do for talent. Destroying a tripwire trap that round. They've both seen this trick before and they are on alert now. Meanwhile, they are fighting in a zone that has been voted to close. They're going to have to make some movements here. Tough choices ahead. Nobody wants to be the first to break away from these fights because then you've got somebody shooting you the whole time you're trying to run, especially when you're tracked like Lakafic is right now. Lakafic not afraid to fire a few arrows over his shoulder, however, to keep Blixman at bay. 
Unfortunately, ults, I am out of zone closure power. So all I have left is an electronic power, a speed up power, and an invincibility power. We do have the points to spend any of those that we want. I am up to you guys for suggestions. Akifik clearing himself into the open zone. Blixman still on his tail. Over here, KYC scouting around. Everybody's gathering in one place. What looks like a four-way competition is about to take place over here, guys. Let's get you a bird's eye view here of exactly how close everybody is. They are all within view if I hover up high enough. We are down to the final four, and this is my third and final match for the day. These are the pre-qualifying rounds. Stay tuned for more information on where you'll be able to catch the next streams. A new electronic is available. Oh, and there we go. Milky Way using a teleport to get himself around. Who deserves a speed up? Whoever receives the victory of this vote will have 10 seconds with unlimited uh, stamina and a higher speed for movement. Really lets people get in and close in on fights. Blixman playing it as safe as he can here. He's really suffering with hit points, as is Lakafik. Blixman looking for a tree to get himself warmed up. And there goes another fight. Milky Way playing super aggressive with that speed up we've given him. That is the best way to do it. Now is his chance to score some good melee hits. Checking all the trees. And the central zone is being closed by RNG. Blixman dies to cold. Blixman, buddy, I don't know what happened. Looks like you couldn't find a tree. We are at the final three. We have got our bronze medal. Oh, and adding insult to injury, the game has decided to spawn a new electronic right here in the middle of zone as the middle zone is being closed out. KYC. Not sure what he's doing over here. He is in the mix. KYC, you've got a lot of ground to cover if you want to get out of this zone. I'll do my best. All right, we're rooting for you, buddy. Milky Way, he has been a strong survivor. Milky, did you think you'd get this far? You were pretty uh, negative about your chances at the beginning of the game. I, I don't know, man. I hope. Huh? You have survived a manhunt. You've got a kill. You are doing yeah. super well, my friend. What's more, Milky Way didn't think he'd be the winner of this match. He's entering the final three competition here with the most health of our other competitors. In fact, he's got more health than the two combined. KYC could not get out of the cold in time. I'm sorry to hear that, my friend. All right, Milky Way putting himself up some armor for this final fight. Meanwhile, Lakovic trying to figure out exactly where the fight's going to come down to. He does have his uh, boots upgraded almost fully, and he's using that axe sharpener. That means instead of doing 150 points of damage per hit, he will be hitting for 175 every time he uh, manages to connect in the melee fight. Those little differences don't sound like a lot, but they can make a big difference in the long run. Yeah, you can resize chat here on Mixer. That's absolutely true. And here comes the sudden death. The walls are closing in. Yeah, two guys dying to the cold because the trees just weren't there to be had. It's weird that they weren't snowball fights. Lakafik coming in behind Milky Way. Stopping him from looting that electronic by shooting the computer. Milky Way firing off, well, one of them firing off a smoke bomb to hide their trail. Both of them looking for the other. Milky Way triggering that radar pulse. He knows exactly what Lakovic is up to at this point. Question is, can he get an angle to take that kill shot? Lakovic, meanwhile, trying to stay ahead of Milky Way. Wants to keep him guessing, wants to keep him frustrated, not letting him know exactly where he's at at any time. Hoping to get that surprise spot and kill. Knows he has to confer his, uh, conserve his hit points at this point. He knows that he's only one hit away from a loss. He does manage to break that armor with a nice shot.
audience, we could gravely influence this game. We could drop an invincibility. What do we think? Does Lactus, do we put this up to a vote? Do we give one of them the opportunity? Remember, when invincible, knockback is greatly increased, which could push them into the cold. We could have another cold death happen here. I'm gonna put it up to you. We are gonna put an invincibility up for the vote. See if we can get a third freeze kill going on this round. Who are we gonna give this invincibility to? What's it gonna do? Those walls are still closing in as the arena shrinks and shrinks. Milky Way takes out Lassific. Milky Way was sure at the start of this round that he was not gonna get the win, but he had surprised everyone, including himself. Milky Way, what a great match, my friend. And that is how we're gonna go ahead and close out match elf. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here. Stay tuned for just a couple minutes. I'm not entirely sure where we're gonna catch the next rounds of this tournament, but I will have that information for you as soon as I can get it. Once again, congratulations to Milky Way closing out match F. Crowd favorite, manhunted, healed, then zone closed. He had a rocky road, but he managed to close out the round with two kills. Hey Dread, how you doing, my friend? One moment, everybody, while I see what's going on. Good to see you, my friend. What are you up to this weekend? I Falcon, we use that uh, here on Mixer as a wave or to raise hands. I'm not sure who it was earlier that told me to move my camera down here in the corner. Does this format work better for you guys? Am I, am I in a better place for you? Because we're going to be doing this again in future weeks. Awesome, guys. I appreciate the feedback. I love to know what makes it better for you guys. I'm looking for information here from my uh, points of contact here. <laughs> they knew I was coming. Oh, Darwin Project itself reporting that they are calculating the final scores to see who makes it into the finals. Stay tuned for that. Match E is still going on. If you guys wanted to uh, see the ongoing adventures right now, you can go visit the uh, stream over at twitch.tv slash X seeing Vogel X. I am putting that chat or I'm putting that into the chat right now. Match E is ongoing. That is a North American match, if I'm not mistaken. Go check out Sing Vogel. She is an awesome show host. Razorline, good to see you, my friend. Excellent. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to go ahead and invite you all to go ahead and move over to that Twitch.tv stream. It sounds like Sing Vogel is going to be doing the final matches from here out. I can't tell you how much I appreciate having you here. Please go ahead and drop me a favor. Drop me a follow if you liked my stream. We're going to be seeing you again in future weeks right here on Mixer.com slash Wolfstar76. I can't tell you enough how much it's been fun having you all here. I hope you were entertained, and I hope to see you all in a future week, guys. I know. I'm sorry to be shutting down. Am I doing non-tournament matches? Uh, I'm done. I actually have other plans for this evening, although if... Uh, you know, if, if Sings were to suddenly lose her voice, I would stick around. But uh, I'm going to be going ahead and closing down my stream for the night. I do stream Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 9 o'clock right here on Mixer. If you want to come check out more of my streams, please do. I've been doing a lot of Darwin Project lately, and I don't see that stopping for the near future. Thanks, everybody. I look forward to seeing all of you as well. Who lost internet? What? <laughs> Mr. Goodcat helping out. Thank you. We do definitely appreciate the uh I'm not sure what's going on. Happy man, I didn't even see you sneak in. All right, everybody, one more time. Please go check out twitch.tv slash singvogel to see what happens from here. These are the pre-qualifying rounds for the community top one hundred. Go check her out to see what happens in the finals rounds from here. Once again, that is twitch.tv slash X X. Cody, can you put that up there for me one more time? Copy paste it from my last one. 
And uh, I'm going to be shutting down from here because I haven't had time to build a brand new... I built a whole new uh, presentation layer for X, in XSplit for this. I haven't had a time to update a uh, closeout scene for, uh, for the Darwin Project. Stay tuned for that next week, guys. Have a great night, everybody. And uh, I look forward to seeing you all one more time. My uh, usual sign-off here, if we run into each other in that big, mean, cold world, please be kind to one another. But more importantly, I always want you to be good to yourselves.